Let's talk about how to add an app to a student device. To view the list of approved apps for K-5 students, you're going to visit the Play Store. I'm going to tap the Play Store. And I will now see all of the apps that have been approved so far for students in Bloomington. Side note, we currently have a experienced kindergarten and first grade teacher who is growing this list specifically for K-1 students. To add an app to my device, I'll simply click that app and I'll select install. It should take a minute or less to download. When the download is complete, you'll get a notification that the app was successfully installed. You'll now be able to open the app on your device. You'll also, if we go back to the home page, you'll also see the app on your furthest panel. So I can see that the app has installed right here. Going back into the Play Store, again, this front page is all of the apps that are available and approved for download for students. But if I come up to the hamburger, and I select My School Apps. I can now see if there's any apps that need to be updated. I can see the apps that have been recently updated. If I move over to the Installed tab, I can see which apps are installed under my ISD 271 account. The library tab is going to show any apps that are available that students have not downloaded yet from the approved library. If it does not say install next to it, it means that that app was available at one point in the library, but it is no longer part of the approved library. The last thing I want to talk about is now that the student has downloaded this app on this specific tablet under their account, they should now be able to log into any tablet in the classroom and still see that same app. During the pilot, we had some issues with this. Uh, I've really troubleshooted it and there's a couple strategies. If students log into a different device and don't see the app that they recently downloaded, they can go to the Play Store on that other device and they can simply search by clicking this search icon in the top right corner. So if I searched we do, it will then pop up. So perhaps it didn't show up as an icon yet on the tablet, but the account does recognize that it's an app the student has access to. One strategy is just wait time. I've noticed that sometimes the app pops right up on another device that they're logged into, but sometimes it takes a little bit more time, perhaps like overnight and it'll show up the next day. I've also noticed that a restart of the device allows that icon to pop up more quickly. But of course, if you're still having issues, please reach out to your media director or go ahead and put in a web help desk ticket. One of the benefits of the tablets is that students can move from device to device in your classroom and still get access to their specific apps and their specific content. So we want this feature to work. So please reach out if you're having any issues.